episode of William and Bird and today we have found a game where we can play with a character that has a bird. This is Paladins. So to be fair all I've done is I jumped into uh, target practice for just a little bit just to get a feel for things and basically mess with some settings and stuff. I really actually kind of have no idea at all what this game is about or anything but I got arrows I've got different arrow I've got an explosive thing I've got a dash I've got uh, an ultimate ability I guess so it's weird um, but apparently this game is somewhat like overwatch so I guess this is the Hanzo character mixed between Hanzo and Bastion because Hanzo because of the bow and Bastion because of the bird um, but yeah, I like I said, I have not really tried this game out at all, so we'll be experiencing it for the first time together. Uh, so I really have no options. Oh, I'm on a horse. Do 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 do. Okay, I'm not even sure how to get on the horse. I mean, I think it auto put me on the horse because it was the beginning of the match. I actually really have no idea what's going on, but I got a bird, and that's really all you need, right? I can jump as well. Okay, so I'm gonna jump a doo da. There we go. Nice. I feel like I'm doing some things. There we go. There we go. This is just a random lobby. Uh oh. Looks like I got stunned, possibly. There we go. Looks like this was an objective, and we fought over it. Now a Z. Z is not mount. How do we mount up? Um, I don't know. Was there a tutorial? Maybe I should have done the tutorial. I feel like we did the good thing though. Okay, um, we're going to... Yeah, there we go. But chow Nice! I'm liking it. Let's find if we can find like some kind of like high ground or something. Don't have any kind of sprint with this character. Uh, let's go explore around. Looks like we're trying to get this objective. And, ooh, I'm liking, I'm liking this. They might come from that area, but I think they're going to come down that way. Ooh, escort the payload. So this really is like Overwatch. It's like Overwatch, but free. Whoa! Why you do this? Come on, I will be the Hanzo. Hanzo main for the win. Well, the question is, does this game have a character like Tracer? Because that would be cool. Also, a bow with six shots, and then you have to reload. Does it quite make sense? But I'll go with it. There we go. I sent my bird out to do things. Oh, so my bird is my ultimate. I don't know what it does exactly, but probably cool things. There we go. Do some damages. There we go. Move that payload. That looks like an ult. I'm scared. Okay. We good now. We are moving this payload like crazy go nuts. So this is good. Looks like this is really similar to Overwatch. I know they said that they didn't copy, but I mean here's the deal though. That's not a bad thing. Overwatch is actually a good game. So having a game that's like Overwatch seems seems like a good thing, not a bad thing. My mouse sensitivity is really weird though. And this is like, I think, the same sensitivity I do with Overwatch, so. There we go. Bow times. Shabam! We got this. Okay, looks like my ult is almost up. I feel like I would enjoy this game more if I actually spent any amount of effort at all to actually learn about my abilities. But I haven't even died yet, which is pretty cool. I think I just wasted my ult. We're jumpity doo dah over here because we are low health. Are there like health packs in this game? Because that would be pretty gnarly. They're like support characters. Can I spam like need healing? Oh, I'm healing. Oh, it's just a passive heal. Okay. I see how it is. Okay. Um, boink. Okie dokie. Payload push. Players. Pushing team have been next to the pace wall. It will roll back like in any other game. Okay. Oh no. We need to uh, move the payload. It's there's a countdown. 
There we go. There we go. We moved up. I don't know if there are headshots in this game. And I don't know how much of this I'm actually doing for my team. But looks like there are kind of headshots. Kind of. So yeah, this is good. We got... I'm liking this bow character area, arrow person. She's uh, pretty gnarly. I will get you. Push failed. What? Wait a second. I I don't quite understand what just happened there. Why did Why did the push fail? Press I to purchase items. Really? So this is actually like a mobile. Oh my goodness. These screen. These screens. Bulldozer. Like. Okay, at least it. Okay, weapon shots deal 50% more damage. That sounds good, I guess. But two deployables. I don't know. Oh, kill the heal. That sounds good. We'll go with that. Okay, so that's what that's what we're gonna do. Maybe you just auto get your horse to run back from spawn, so you don't need like symmetric teleporters. It seems like it kind of defeats the purpose of eliminations unless they just like spawn you so far back which I guess they might okay hmm we're gonna jump a dee doo -da over there get some flanks going for the flank oh no one expects the flanks there we go flanking I feel like I did good things for my team there. Apparently playing Overwatch has really helped, like the skill set has uh, gone over a little bit. Unlike when I play like Battlefield or Call of Duty or Halo or any of those games. Well, Halo because that's controller, so. But anyway, all of those games just like, I don't get the uh, same kind of like value from all the practice that I've done. Because I'm not good at those kind of games. So that's... It's nice to be able to like jump into a game like this is literally my first match and yet I'm doing things. I'm not using my abilities and I'm not understanding like the nuances and everything and my ult is on E instead of Q. That's something I need to change. Um, but it's still like, like I'm figuring this out even though I have lots of questions and I mean Overwatch was like immediately amazing. Of course I did watch a whole lot of videos on Overwatch before I played it so I mean it's not quite fair to judge them because what I've played a hundred like 140 hours of overwatch and this is my first match of paladins so like I really can't judge it yet but this bow character sounds feels really nice like feels as nice as like I can actually hit with my basic attack which is something I can't really do with Hanzo but Hanzo has a scatter arrow which is just like amazing also people tend to have more health because like I'm not dying and I mean he's trickling in so we're in overtime right now see I mean I understand that there's like a objective and jumpity doodah into a wall because pro strats and stuff um yeah hey Batlicker hey what's up I remember you from, uh, what was it, Evolve we were playing? Yeah. Welcome back. So yeah, like I've been saying, uh, this is my very first game as Paladins. And I was just like, hey, it's free. I'll try it out. And I heard that it was like Overwatch and like that was the problem with it. And uh, hey, it being like Overwatch is a good problem to have. Because Overwatch is an amazing game. I'm going to get you. There we go. I feel so pro right now. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm not with AI. Like, these are people. We play Guns of Icarus. Oh, okay. Guns of Icarus. That's right. I knew it was something like that. Evolving Guns of Icarus are very different games, though. Yeah, I should, I should do some more Guns of Icarus at some point. I haven't done a lot of videos on the channel in a while for that game. I love that game. I played that so much. Yeah, I thought the same. Really wanted to play Overwatch. But I have Mac. Ah! Oh! Yes, I was in those days for so long. That's why I've, that's why I played Overwatch so much. To be honest, is just because, like, it works on Mac, and I mean you can't really argue with that. Here we go, getting the kills. So if I'm on the attacking team, do I just have more hit points? Am I on the a god team? 
like, am I just pro? What is happening? Because I haven't died, like, at all. I don't understand this. I'm never this good at a game when I first pick it up. So, I don't know. This is cool, though. I'm enjoying it. Uh, let's see. Uh, the cards. Healing just sounds good. Utility? Uh, I don't even want to know. This is probably movement speed. Okay, let's see. Uh, hopefully this is nearer. This is, like, for everyone. Increase the range while you're stealth. Reduce. We're just going to go simple. We're going to get healing when you get a kill because that makes sense in my mind and movement speed sounds good ooh ultimate charge sure we'll go with that yeah you have to uh, yeah the same way I want to play it you may want to check uh, aggregation ooh I will look that up if I remember the last time someone told me about a game I should check out on the stream it was Many fun times to be had. Nice. Okay. Oh no. Okay. So I forgot. I'm like a backline sniper instead of a frontliner. Okay. That person was like at one pixel for a long time. I'm going to go do the flanks. There we go. Haha. <laughs> Apparently flanks. Super pro strat. Nice. Fluffy, what are you saying back there? Uh, it's not a game. It's a card that you can buy. Oh, aggregation. Okay, thanks. That's helpful. That's one of the things I like about Twitch is you can uh, play and have people teach you the game instead of like... Because, yeah, I'm not quite sure how things work. But that knockback shot is really fun. And... Okay, so that seems to like do damage. There we go. ship -a -doo. Come on. Yeah, there we go. So I don't know if the like hitboxes are really lenient, because usually I'm not good. Or maybe it's just because these targets are super big. Like, these character models are really large, so maybe that's why I'm able to hit stuff. Or maybe it's just because it was my first game and I played a lot of Overwatch, so I was, everyone I was played with, was it was also their first game. But, 59 eliminations, 87,000 damage. I don't have any like aspect to say if these were good stats or not, but anyway, thank you everybody some for watching that episode. Fluffy's up there. I'll get him later. But thank you. So tell me if you want to see more videos of these on the channel, and until next time, I'll see y'all later. Bye.